Well, one of the bigger concerns this earnings season is the ability of companies to generate sales. Many analysts say weak top-line growth could turn into a full-blown revenue recession. Bob Bassani explains why this important part of the earnings picture seems to be stalling out. Earnings season is in full swing, and once again, earnings are likely to be flat. The main reason is continuing weakness in revenues. Earnings for the S&P 500 are expected to be down 3.8 percent. That's according to FactSet. However, those numbers typically rise as reports come in, so earnings are likely to be flat for the quarter at the end of the day. Well, that's not great, but revenues are expected to be down 4.2 percent, and that's not likely to change too much. Why has there been no revenue growth? Well, partly it's because companies have not been able to raise prices. There's also been fairly slack demand as economic growth has been very tepid. But there's an additional reason. Oil companies have seen a dramatic 35% drop in revenues. In fact, if you remove energy stocks from the S&P 500, revenue growth would be up 1.6% rather than down 4.2%. Revenue declines, if they continue, are going to make it very difficult to have profit growth. So the question is, Will the declines continue? The two wild cards to watch are oil and the dollar. If oil prices rise, energy companies will have stronger profits and revenues. And this strong dollar has reduced the overseas profits of multinational companies based in the U.S. and it's made exports less competitive. So a weaker dollar would also be a big help to revenue growth. For Nightly Business Report, I'm Bob Bassani at the New York Stock Exchange.